everyone, it's Andy from Hobby Headquarters. Well, I have two exciting new Tamiya car kits to share with you, uh, which is kind of unusual because usually you don't get two brand new Tamiya cars back to back like that. In fact, when I first got the box, I opened it up, kind of looked at it, I go, oh, a Toyota, a Subaru. Cool, two new car kits. And I kind of stacked them off to the side, and I was doing some other work when working on another YouTube video. And I kind of looked over to the side, and I'm looking at the Edge box art, which I'll show you in a second right here. I'm like, wow, those look very, very... Wait a minute, those are identical looking cars. So, of course, then I pulled them out, looked them up a little bit more, and noticed they are. They are about 90% the exact same car. The main difference being the uh, the front end, the grill area. They were done in cooperation between, the real cars I'm talking about now, between Subaru and Toyota. So, Toyota had Subaru uh, use the engine off the Subaru, and they just each designed their own front end on it. So... It's an interesting way for two big car companies to share some of the expenses of bringing out a new car. Uh, you know, you can divide it up among two companies. It's not as expensive. From what I understand, these are very low margin cars for the real companies. So they don't make a ton of money on it like they do like their trucks and things. So it makes it good so they can bring a lot of these out to the public and not kill them with the costs on it. So when we look inside the boxes now, luckily... To me, has dyed the plastic, at least for the body, in two different colors. So the Toyota, this one right here, is molded in white. And the Subaru is molded in this blue color, similar to the, the box art right here. So when we show them side by side, it's very interesting the way Tamiya molded these, which I'll show you in a second. And that way we can keep them straight so I'm not mixing the two parts up between the boxes. So... Uh, it's a really cool. I'm glad they're coming out with these. I know the last Toyota sold very, very well, and I'm excited to get these in. From what I understand, they are both due out sometime in December, so very, very soon, about a month, month and a half from now. And I'm excited to show you inside. So, let's get started. Okay, the first thing we're going to take a look at are the bodies. As you can see, we have them side by side here. The blue one is the Subaru BRZ. The white one is the Toyota GR86. And because I, I have a blue cloth down here first, we're going to kick the blue one to the side because it's kind of hard to see the blue uh, up against the other blue. And since they're identical, we're just going to show you the white body first. and Or actually, just, just show you the white body to let you see what it is. Let you take a look at how how they've molded this one right here, but uh, rest assured, they are identical in every way, shape, or form. So that is our body. Next up, we are taking a look at the, uh, the sprue that has the uh, suspension in it, the exhaust, the wheels, and some of those other parts. And if you'll notice, they're side by side. The top half from this portion up is identical on both kits. And the way Tamiya has done it is they've changed the gate out. So on the left side, we have the grill and the lights, the back of the lights at least, for the Toyota. And on the, uh, the right side, we have the Subaru BRZ. So what we're going to do is we're going to first take a look at this one here. This is our Toyota. And you can see how the grill is on this. Try to get enough light reflecting off it so you can see all the detail. And then the suspension part. So we have our suspension area, some of the exhaust. Move this out of the way, it might get a little distracting. Very shiny black plastic we're dealing with right here. And then right into the wheels. And let you just see all that stuff up. Get a little close up on the suspension arms. Those look really nice. And then we'll flip over to the Subaru, which all that other stuff is the same. The only difference is, is this part of the sprue, the J portion of the sprue. And you can see how the grill is different on that. Next up, we have the clear parts. And clear parts, just like those exhaust parts, are the same thing. 90% of the, uh, the molding is universal. And then the only difference is this top portion, which, depending on which gate they opened up, they produced the two different pieces of, or two sets of glass. So overall, we're looking at the four, first portion here. And then these are the lights for the Subaru. And these are the front lights for the Toyota. That's the main difference there. And everything else is the same. 
Now we are taking a look at the universal chrome pieces and this exact sprue is shared in both kits. Both identical. Uh, you also obviously get four tires and poly caps and I've opened up one of them right here. They are going to be the same pieces inside each one but that lets you take a look at the tread on here. There's the tread on those particular ones. And finally, we have another universal sprue. This has the inside of the vehicle. So the inside of the doors, the seats, the dashboard, all the other little parts like that. And I will zoom in on this and let you take a quick look at all those. So here's our dash. There's the front seats. Like the center console, steering wheel, the inside of the doors, and even the windshield wipers. And this particular sprue is shared inside both kits identically. Nothing different between the two of those. Also included inside each one of the kits, we have a complete set of masking st stickers. Now, they are different in the kit and because of the lights on it. Now, this particular time, I've just opened up the Toyota just to show you, but they're pretty much the same looking masking stickers. So you get a set of masking stickers, a set of decals because the, like the license plates and a little bit of the, uh, the instrument panel might be slightly different. And then finally, you also get a set of the, uh, these are like the chrome foil for the mirrors, these are identical on both kits as well. So all three of these will be inside both kits. And finally, we are going to take a look at the instructions. In this particular case, we are looking at the Toyota GR86, but keep in mind, both kits build almost identically. And we like to show you the instructions, that way you know what you are getting into when you purchase this kit. So I won't talk anymore for the rest of the instructions, and just let you look at what's inside it. And there you are. There is a quick look at the new Tamiya Toyota GR86 and the new Tamiya B Subaru BRZ. Both brand new kits due out very soon. Uh, I know earlier in the video I said that they were due out in early to mid-December, but now I have another distributor telling me that they actually won't be out until early January. So sometime between mid-December to early January, we should see these here. Both of them have a price of about $40, so I think a, a pretty good value considering how nice looking they are. Uh, which one do you guys like? I keep going back and forth between the grills, obviously the rest of the car is the same. I'm kind of leaning a little bit more towards the Subaru grill, liking that one a little bit better, but it's, it's kind of a toss up right there. But please go down in the comments and tell me which one you like the best there. I'd like to like to hear from you guys. And then obviously the colors, we can change those up at any time, but uh, I do like the white plastic in the Toyota kit. So if we decide to do any other car besides blue, it'll be easier to film. So I want to take this opportunity to thank you as always for watching and please stay tuned because we have many more videos coming.